YTBC, this is your boy Coach Shelton Harrison. Okay, and in this video, I'm going to take the time to debunk a goofy video by a YouTuber uh, that's pretty much claiming that Floyd is afraid to face Manny Pacquiao. Let me go ahead and take a sip of this Jamaican brew before I get going. Mm. Ah, God, dog, <laughs> dang, son. Woo! Okay, let me go ahead and dig into this go this goofy video. Okay, so a guy drops this goofy video, and he says that Floyd is afraid of Manny. Manny was, you know, saying that, you know, that he wants to fight Floyd. You know, after he fights again, he wants to fight Floyd. Okay, now we know this. Everybody in the YTBC, we already know that Manny want to fight again after Bradley. We, he wants to, and he wants that person to be Floyd Mayweather, okay? There's only one thing. Floyd is retired. He's not coming out of retirement. If you're retired, and I've heard from a very, very, very reliable source, a very reliable source that Floyd ain't coming back out of retirement. Okay, he just not. And you know, for some reason, I guess the guy making a goofy video and Pacquiao, they just seem to think that they're gonna lure Mayweather out of retirement. Like, how's Pacquiao gonna do that? Is Pacquiao as Rasputin? Is he going to snap his magical fingers, throw some salt water on the damn situation, and, and sprinkle salt water over, over Floyd's head to change Floyd's mind about coming out of retirement? The hell with Pacquiao! Floyd ain't coming out of no retirement, you damn dimwit! He ain't coming out of retirement! And you, the guy who dropped that goofy video, I dare you to come on this channel and I dare you to leave a comment because I'm going to eat you alive in the comment section. And for those of you that you're coming around, you're running around from video to video, Coach, why are you still talking about Floyd? Because I want to still talk about Floyd. If I want to talk about Floyd, I talk about Floyd if I want to. Now you get your goofy ass off this video and know your level and shut up. That's what you guys do. Talking about Floyd gonna come out of retirement to fight Manny Pacquiao and the man's retired. Pacquiao, you're nothing but a liar. You're a liar. First of all, you get in there and get schooled. You see, I'm gonna revisit this every chance I get. And you Pacquiao slash GGG fans, because we know you all the same. Every chance I get. I'm going to come here and I'm going to revisit this because Pacquiao, you got taken to school. You can slow the video down. You can piss on the video. You can look at the video sideways. You know what, Pacquiao? You are, you are phony, man. And instead of just saying, you know what, Floyd? You was the better man that fight. No, you got robbed. No, Pacquiao, you're saying that you got robbed and you're giving everybody a bogus excuse. Oh, my shoulder hurt. My shoulder hurt, you pansy. I mean, shut up, Pacquiao. Shut up. Running around here talking about you want to rematch Floyd Mayweather. And, and, and you're talking about your shoulder been hurt. But you was in the ring throwing all kind of wild haymaker punches. And you got your idiot trainer, Frederick Roach, saying the same stupid lie. Man, I wish somebody would come up there and smack the taste out your mouth. Smack the taste out his mouth, baby. Smack the taste out his mouth. Ridiculous. You talking about you going to get Floyd back in the ring. How you going to do that, Manny? You got your ass embarrassed the first time, Manny. Freddie, he ain't getting back in the ring. And Floyd is not going to get in the ring. Floyd's done. And you know what happened the second time around? Freddie Roach, Manny Pacquiao, you would get embarrassed again. You know why you get embarrassed again? Because you can't match the man skill for skill. You need to go ahead and face that. You know what? Get this last fight out of your system. Retire. Take your ass back to the Philippines and become a congressman like you said. Manny, it's over for you. It is over. And you are no longer, okay, dude, you're, you're, you're of age. You're, what, you're 36 years old, 37, 36. Manny, hang up the gloves, shut the hell up, and know your level. That's what you do. You... You're an A fighter that fought a professional, terrific fighter. You got outclassed by the better man. I mean, it's time to let this go. And it's time for some of you goofy fans making your goofy videos to let this go. I don't care anymore. Because I'm sick and tired of you guys trying to put salt water on Floyd Mayweather's name. Look, just say the man is great. Just say that you want the man to lose. Say, I can't stand a bastard and I want him to lose. 
That's what you guys need to start saying. Because to run around here and make the same accusation that Floyd did not win that fight is just pure stupidity. It's stupid. And you guys can't let it go. The damn fight happened in May. In May. It's December. You guys are still running around here. I think Manny won the fight. It did good. And shut up. Shut up. Just shut up. Bunch of negative people. And you know what? Manny Pacquiao's a hater. He's a hater. You know, good and well you lost that fight. Now, nah, instead of giving a man his props and say, you know what, I lost the fight, but, you know, let me go home and train. And that ain't no excuse. Let me go home and train and let me really prepare. And, Floyd, I want you again. You know what? That's a fight that people probably would have wanted to see. But don't nobody want to see that fight now. Nobody, because everybody know what will happen. Even the Floyd Mayweather Jr. detractors. You know exactly what's going to happen. He gonna get in the ring again. He would get outclassed. He would get schooled. He get caught with that right hand, caught with the left hand. That same lancing body to the blow. Floyd is gonna move out the way. He's going to prevent Manny. He's gonna smother Manny Pacquiao's offense. What is Pacquiao gonna do? He's gonna get the same thing. But you know what? I get this now. Now I'm gonna make you fanboys mad. I'm gonna keep talking about Floyd. Floyd this, Floyd that. That's what it's gonna be. Okay, I'm gonna talk about Floyd every chance I get. Every time I get the urge to just mess with some of you fanboys, and especially that idiot that dropped this goofy video. You dropped a goofy video talking about you think Floyd Mayweather scared of Pacquiao, but, but, but Pacquiao got out class the first time. You talking about I slowed the video down and Pacquiao won the fight, actually. He really did win the fight. Shut up, you stupid, you stupid, uh, you idiot. Heck, you gonna make that video for? YouTube need to just they need to put need to pull a muzzle on who can drop a video. We just need an idiot test. Like what the heck, man? You can't give the man his props. You can't tell the man that hey, you really did defeat me, and that's what happened. Please, I'm not trying to hit it. But you got goofy ass people running around YouTube talking about the fight. Uh, man, he got robbed. Manny Pacquiao didn't get robbed. Hell, his biggest supporter, Max uh, Kellerman. They all, all of them, even Jim damn Lampley said Floyd won the fight. Now, you know if Jim Lampley talking about Floyd did anything, right? You know Manny ain't got a pot to piss in. But you guys still want to bring it up. But I got something for you. And for you that made that goofy video, you better know your level, shut your damn mouth, and quit putting up these goofy videos about nonsense. This is your boy, Coach Shelton Harris. I'm done.